Hey everybody, this is Michael with BackToTheFutureTrading.com and this is another wonderful episode of Ninja Trader oh. Unplugged. Swing. Okay, so in our last video we were talking about how to use a GAN principle, uh, that is the power of the 50% retracement, in determining levels that the market you're trading is most likely to uh, reflect on and or bounce away from. You can use the word pivot if you want to. Gann believed that everything in the universe was subject to something that he called the law of vibration. And he said that everything in the markets were uh, a reflection of that vibrational law. So if you remember from our last video, we had uh, sort of instructed you to find the low and the high of the previous day. This is just one of many different techniques that you can use. It's a great uh, first time out the gate lesson to learn and uh, draw some fibs. Let me show you what I mean. Come over here, take your uh, top level, which is at 84 half from yesterday and drop it down to 66. And there's uh, a 50% line right there. So now <clears throat> you have the makings of your ladder for today. So come over here, take that line that fib, copy it, right click, copy, right click, paste. And now if you hold the control key down and hold the left mouse button down on this axis, you see how we have some more ladder rungs above us? Yeah. Let's do the second thing below us actually. We'll do the same thing, right click, copy, right click, paste, and then drag down that 50% retracement underneath us. And so now left click on the price axis and drag down and you'll compress those bars to see what's sitting there. So right now we've got a pretty good range uh, above us and below us here. If you wanted to just kind of cover your bases, you can copy and paste those ladder rungs uh, above you and or below you one last time just to make sure you're not having to go back during the market and do that so where you go from there most traders have an average risk reward tolerance and a lot of the traders I meet are day traders and they're looking for two ES points of profit with around two ES points of risk so then it just becomes a question now of taking each of these zones and then pulling down your halfway points until they're broken into two point zones of profit and risk. So go to your pencil tool, click on stay in draw mode. And this way you don't have to keep picking the Fibonacci retracements tool over and over again. Okay, and then I want you to just fill in each of these blanks, cutting them in half over and over and over again with your 50% fib tool. Okay, and none of this will be applicable until the market opens here in uh, about an hour and a half today. So just taking these lines and filling them in with halfway retracements you're going to have a pretty cool looking ladder of support and resistance. Now, this ladder is a very close approximation to the natural vibrational pattern of this market. You can see here right now the gap is 84.50 to 87. So about two and a half dollars of risk to reward. And when the market opens here in a few minutes, now it's a question of understanding which one of these levels will it bounce at. And I've got two different philosophies for you um, to entertain here today. Number one, if you are a counter trend trader, counter trend trader, forgive me, you can look for highs and lows. And one of the ways you can do that is by 
going down to the free Ninja Trader indicator, which is the Keltner channel. And if you bring the Keltner channel onto your chart, now you'll see that there's this sort of band that follows you around. And when you are near the lower band, according to mean reversion or volatility theory, when you're at the lower band, the market is hypothetically overextended towards the downside. And that sort of communicates that, hey, maybe this level right here is a level that we can use in addition to that band to target a reversal. And then vice versa. As we come up into the higher band, we target the next level above us as an even weaker area where people are most likely to bounce and go down. So as you're watching these levels today, if, if you're following along and, and drawing these lines, uh, depending on when Ninja puts the video out, just look for a standard Keltner channel and then watch for the levels where the lines sort of cross. If the candle closes above a support line, wait for the next resistance level if it's above the upper band. If a candle is at or below the lower band, watch for the support level underneath it. Okay, so that's sort of technique number one. Technique number two is going to be using the trend. And so here I have a uh, free indicator which is available to all of our unplugged friends. And I've got mine, uh, this EMA slope color set to a 120 period moving average. And so now when this market opens here in a few minutes, I'm going to be looking for the direction of the trend. And right now you can see as of yesterday, the trend direction was up. So if that's the case, this indicator can help me determine if everyone is buying, I want to be looking for pullbacks in the direction of the trend. And so if the market is trending up, I want to be using these levels as support areas to look for bounces to the upside. Again, there's uh, a prevalence, a tendency, if everybody is buying, that's an additional statistical edge. If we're seeing higher highs and higher lows, these levels can provide an additional reason for a purchase and really help us locate entries, stops, and targets. And then conversely, if the trend is moving down, you want to use the levels as retracements to sell from. And put your stops above the opposite line, put your target another ladder rung away. So between the Keltner channel and the trend technique, you'll be able to sort of laser focus target where you want to make your stand and you'll see some really good setups play out there again using nothing but free indicators and or ninja trader indicators included in your default list hope this helps we'll continue the technique in our ongoing series here at ninja trader unplugged hey we are sold out for ninja trader we love the guys and gals over there love everything about the platform and we are 100 percent ninja trader certified sold out loonies for the platform. If you want to tap into the free indicators and templates and workspaces that we create for the Ninja Trader community, just go ahead to backtothefuturetrading.com forward slash unplugged. All we need is your first name and your email. We're going to send you a link to our Dropbox where I store all of the free indicators and templates that I build in these videos so you don't have to build them from scratch. You just have to load them and take it from there. If you're curious about the shenanigans we're doing over in the website and in our webinars, head over to backtothefuturetrading.com. Go ahead, click on view demo, and you will see all of the magical things that we're talking about with our software here as well. This has been another episode of Ninja Trader Unplugged. Stay tuned and I'll show you another way to build on the techniques that we're using in this video series using GAN's 50% rule to find the highs and lows, the turning points of the markets predictively for the upcoming sessions in the markets that you trade. Thanks again. You guys have a great afternoon and good trading.